Hi, I'm Edward Francis, one of the senior partners at Ost Migration and Settlement Services. This video is one of the many episodes in our Working in Australia series that will guide you through various visa opportunities within Australia for general skills and also industry individuals who are looking to migrate or work in Australia. In this episode, I will discuss the various English language tests that you can take to demonstrate your English capacity. Before we discuss this important topic, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell and follow our social sites so that you always remain updated on the coming episodes. Aside from skills assessment, meeting English language requirement is one of the mandatory requirements for Australian study or migration application or even employer sponsored visas. Meeting English language through nationality is an option if you possess valid passport from UK, US, Canada, New Zealand and Republic of Ireland. As you are a passport holder of this country, it will enable you to meet functional, vocational and competent English. To pursue general skills migration, you must meet competent English or higher to get the best possible points in meeting the minimum 65 points or higher. The department accepts five English test providers which are IELTS, TOEFL IBT, PTE, OET and Cambridge English. These five English test providers are also accepted by many institutions organizations if you are planning to study or work in Australia. Each test provider has a different point system. Here is a glance. With shorter preparation, machine or computer based tests can be an option. However, other tests with technical interviews or demonstration can also be affected by personal biases, hence could be a factor in receiving lower scores, especially in speaking band score. For listening test, this is also subject to personal bias with a live assessor versus a computer assessment of PTE. The reading test is commonly reading passages, their queries and related answers. PTE is still computer based for reading assessment. Medical professionals have the option of taking OET tests versus other providers as it is designed specifically for healthcare or medical professionals. Lastly. Writing is assessed differently by each test provider. This could suggest a strategy that you can do when you are strong or weak at a particular component. Playing to your strength when determining what test to take helps you lessen the burden of getting a good score. If reading is your weakest link, I can recommend taking IELTS or PTE as an unbiased assessment with guidelines that can help you achieve a higher score. If writing is the weakest link, PT is a good choice as it is fully computer based with a rigid structure that can help you get superior English. If your test includes technical interview and you're not comfortable with face to face assessment, PTE is your option as it is fully machine based and TOEFL when you speak given computer prompts but manually assessed by an assessor. As I've stated earlier, OET is highly suggested for medical or health professionals as its components are related and are designed for those professionals. Over the years, I had clients come and ask for advice on English test providers and their best chance of scoring the highest score, a superior English. My team is committed to working with you to ensure smooth, stress-free visa application process and easy integration into an Australian society. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to drop a comment below, send an email or give us a call on 0396548611 or email us on info at austamasas.com.au. Once again, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that we can keep you updated with the coming episodes.